Hey y'all, K Pisces here. Here is your bone reading for the week, and if you hear me sniffing, it's because I was on a motorcycle all night and it was cold. And those of you who know, no. <laughs> all right, much love to you. I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Hey, Earth Signs K here. So let's get into it now. It's a couple of things, but let me just say this: I feel like some of y'all may be fed up with a motherfucker with a bullshit. And it's time to move on. But I do think that some of y'all not moving on. Because I, I won't say it's time to move on. I feel like there's a fine line here about what the fuck you about to do and what you tired of dealing with. Okay, let me just say. you. Okay, so you may draw the line on somebody because you've been holding shit back and it's time to let it go. Okay, it's time to let it go. Let it out. And be like, you know what? Go straight to hell. I really feel like some of y'all may want to go and be done with this person, okay? Just saying, you may want to be done, okay? I think it's may, there may be some situations where you've been waiting to see what the fuck is going to go on, and it's just like, there's really no cure to what the hell you doing. So, I got to make a choice what the fuck I'm going to do about you, because there's been a lot of indecision concerning what you're going to do for real and now you've been real, real patient you know about what you're going to do and maybe you came back to this person maybe you decided you want to start over and it just seems like there may have been a lot of arguments and them not you know doing what they're supposed to do things ain't changed and stuff and you seen the light of another day and you just feel like no i'm really not in the mood for this i really can be happy all by my goddamn self or with somebody else. Now, I feel there may have been someone who was trying to get with you, get on with you, you know what I'm saying, holler, whatever. And you may have been giving this person the okie doke. But now it seems like, you know what, I have no, it's no harm in me talking to somebody else when I'm about to end this shit. I mean, I mean, do what you want to do. I hate y'all business. But um, you may feel, like I said, there's no harm in you starting something with somebody else now if this you and this person don't live together that you've been dealing with lately the person you've been with not the new person or the old person that's about to be new if it's someone you've already you already fed up with you may go ahead and decide to have a talk with them about what you deserve and what you well not what you deserve we're gonna, we ain't gonna start there about what you expect from them regarding a calm and cool and reciprocated relationship but they may still be like on some bullshit like oh I had this person forever and they gonna do what the fuck I say and all this kind of yang yang bullshit just talking outside your neck get you sh slap I'm gonna say shot I'm not gonna say that <laughs> it's it came out Disclaimer, dial 911 for emergencies, and I do not condone violence. That's bullshit, but I have to say it. So, um, <laughs> boys coming out, ain't it? Okay, anyway, that's y'all. Pluto strong. So, um, ooh, I just really feel like this may turn into you or this other person, like, seeing somebody else, talking to somebody else. I just feel like some of y'all, one of y'all may start another relationship before the other one is ended. Or, lover, a friend turned lover, a lover turned friend. I don't know. It may be something like that. It just seemed like, okay, let me just say for some of y'all, okay. You may have somebody, and you may have somebody who's a friend who been, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to say thick and thin. <laughs> I'm going to say somebody who you've grown to love and, you know, maybe you love a little too much. I mean, do what you do, okay? This may turn into something much greater. That's just another sad note, okay? Just a little sad note. Um, this other thing there may be uh some hashing out of some situations, you know what I'm saying? Situations in which you may feel like, okay, I've been with this person for a while and I talked to them for a while and maybe I should. But this other person, like I said, might be thinking they can just do what the fuck they want to do because after I get this person back, 
and they get back in my clutches, they better sit their ass down and shut the fuck up and do what the fuck I say. Because I'm not in the mood for no shit. Maybe this is your attitude towards them, but I really feel like somebody thinks either they can get over on you because of the emotional hold they have on you, maybe of what you've done before, you know, showing that you love somebody and you did what they, you know, try to make things better. And it seems like it was only you trying to make shit better, not they ass. Okay. Now that's some bullshit if I ever heard, but you may catch them saying something stupid as hell. And you like, you know what? I'm about to ease my fucking ass back out of this shit because what you doing is just not it's not the move okay i don't think you're gonna tell this person you may not share with them that you back on your way out if you decide to take this person back i don't think you're going to tell show them like i said i think it's gonna be not a secret but omitting that you are walking away what same thing or you know whatever um, you may be not saying you're going to walk away, but you're going to. You're going to because you're sick and tired of it. Maybe you'll sneak out and then you'll say what you should say. Like, look, uh, I'm gone and um, have a nice life, bitch. Okay. <laughs> look, I don't know. And I see you like, you know, chucking deuces at them, which is for those who don't know. Don't have a peace sign, okay? If y'all don't know, you know, black slang for all of you who are in other countries and whatever, or just in America and completely oblivious, okay? You check and deuces to them. I mean, you know, whatever. And I see you being happy when you uh, drive, like driving off like a car full of shit. You know, you packed all your stuff and you happy like this is it i'm i'm over it i'm not gonna get all emotional over this because it's not something that i should be getting myself all in arms over and you're at you feel this calm about it probably because you've done everything you could do and you know sometimes shit at the end of the road you know what i'm saying it's like you having a 110 year old grandma you know it hurts yeah but she 110 years old what the fuck you expect I mean, we know we going to die. People born dead. You know? So, it's like you've come to terms with whatever you have to do. Now, some of y'all, you may be having a funeral for your feelings at this point in the reading. So, like I always say, <laughs> you may be having a funeral for your feelings. But I think some of y'all may go ahead and try to stick this out with this person. I mean, if you do, give them a few months. But really... You may be at the point where you know this is the end of the road and you just got to work some shit out and you done. Okay? So, I think that's all I have for you, Earth Signs. I love y'all and much love to you and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.